uh, welcome my dear students uh, in this video i am going to explain income and uh, wealth inequality in pakistan here i am using wid uh, website that is uh, world inequality database so let me start with the background of the issue uh, let us suppose uh, we are walking through the center of lahore and there are very beautiful malls and uh, uh, cars that reflect the influence of a few people but uh, then there are some uh, poor people that also live there in the suburbs or in the slum areas in the narrow and shadowed passageways families struggle with poverty their hopes diminishing beneath the weight of economic inequity the street of karachi bustling with energy hide beneath them the shadows of disparity this disparity is not a coincidence it reflects a severely impaired system the situation is significantly worse in rural areas the core of pakistan's agricultural industry small farmers confront con constant obstacles like outdated technology poor infrastructure and restricted market access so there is a, a glaring uh, inequalities that uh, uh, are there their suffering is routinely disregarded and the roar of urban expansion muffles their voices the figures are dismal and uh, instructive according to current figures pakistan's richest 10% own about 40% of the total wealth while the bottom 40% live on a meager 17% so this is a very serious inequality Uh, this gap is more than simply numbers on a page it represents millions of people trapped in a mire of stagnation vicious circle of poverty denied basic human rights and uh, opportunities uh, this discrepancy has multiple causes including de decades of uh, political turmoil and unrest and even economic policies and a poor educational system the children of the wealthy receive world class education in top class schools preparing them for uh, prominent universities and high paying employment in a stark contrast millions of children from low income households are denied even basic schooling uh, stifling their uh, potential for, from the beginning this inequality is further aggravated by the shadow of corruption the wealth gap grows as a result of opportunities and resources that are frequently misdirected or diverted by unhealthy behavior and ethical behavior resources intended for development and reducing poverty seldom reach those in need owing to a lack of democratic oversight and accountability uh, in this uh, table you can see average per capita income and per capita gdp of pakistan uh, from the year 1950 up to 2023 and uh, these are figures in 1000 pakistani rupees so you can see this is a per capita income starting with the 1052 260 and uh, here uh, in 2023 this figure is a uh, 643414 and these are the figures for per capita gdp uh, these are the uh, graphs of the this is the average uh, national income uh, this is a uh, average national income and this is uh, this blue one is uh, the gross domestic product and uh, th both of them have risen over time uh, taking this in uh, pakistani rupee uh, of uh, 2022 uh, regarding how to measure inequality uh, one of the most A widely used uh, measure is uh, gini index or uh, gini ratio uh, this was developed by italian statistician corrado gini in 1912 the gini index determines a nation's level of income inequality by measuring the income distribution or wealth distribution across its population the coefficient of gini index ranges from 0 are 0% to 1 or 100% with 0 representing perfect equality where everybody receive equal income and 1 representing perfect inequality where uh, everything is owned by 1% and rest of the people don't have anything south africa has the world world's worst level of income inequality at a gini index 
a ranking of 63% according to the World Bank. Norway, on the other hand, had the lowest level of income inequality and Gini coefficient for Norway was uh, uh, reported as 22.7% uh, by the World Bank. The level of income inequality in the USA was 39.8%. Uh, for Pakistan, the Gini coefficient regarding national income inequality was uh, 0 0.55 and for wealth inequality it was 0 0.75 in the year 2022. So both uh, income inequality and wealth inequality based on uh, Gini coefficient uh, both of them are high for Pakistan. Uh, this is a kind of uh, uh, the feeling how what, what, what inequality means. So you can see. Uh, in this uh, uh, table we can see Gini coefficient for Pakistan from the year 1990-1980 up to 2022 and uh, throughout these years uh, the average uh, Gini coefficient is 0 0.55 or 55% uh, only. In the year 2005, this was slightly high uh, with the 57%. But again, in 2022, Gini coefficient uh, was again 52%. Uh, this is the ratio of top 20 to bottom 50%. And uh, this ratio is around about 13.5 in um, 1980. And uh, again, in 2022, uh, it's uh, 13.52, and there are some uh, fluctuation, uh, small fluctuation in these figures over these years. Uh, this is the graph of the Gini coefficient of national income from 1980 to 22. So, as I mentioned, only in the year uh, 2005, this was slightly here. This is the Gini coefficient that was about. 57 percent and uh, it was lowest here in this year. So finally this is uh, in 2022 it is again 53 percent and then in uh, 2022 it's uh, around about 55 percent. This is the uh, top 20 to bottom 50 percent ratio of the national income for Pakistan from 1980 to 2022 and uh, this is uh, the ratio that I just uh, explained in the table before. Uh, this table shows national income inequality in Pakistan and um, this shows the percent share in total income. So this is the uh, income share of the bottom 50% of the population which uh, fluctuates around uh, uh, 16 percent from 15 to 17 percent. This is the share of the top 10 percent. So the top, the share of top 10 percent in the um, income is uh, high and this is top 1 percent. So this shows if we compare this and this the bottom 50 percent and the top 4 percent are almost uh, having the same uh, percentage share in the income. But uh, so far as the top 10% are concerned, their share in the total income is much more higher than the bottom 50%. So this shows uh, glaring inequalities of income in Pakistan. Uh, in this uh, figure, we can see this red line shows the pre-tax national income of the top 10%. This blue line, dash line, blue dash line shows the pre-tax national income of the bottom 50 percent and uh, this line uh, shows the pre-tax national income of top 1 percent. So these are more or less the same but uh, this is the top 10 percent share percentage share in the total national income is much higher. So this shows this gap shows the uh, the uh, inequality or the gap between the top 10 percent and uh, uh, bottom 50 percent. Uh, this also shows the uh, Gini coefficient of uh, 0 0.75 and a ratio of top 20 to bottom 50 percent that is a uh, uh, 65.11. These are the income share of uh, bottom 50 percent 16.3 for year 2022 and this is the income share of the middle 40% uh, and this is top 10%. Uh, so their share is 43.8%, uh, almost 44%. So you can see 
how much is the difference between the percentage share of the top 10 percent and the percentage share of the bottom uh, 50 percent uh, this shows income distribution in pakistan uh, this is uh, from uh, up to 20 percent of the population their share is uh, 4.5 percent from 21 to 40 percent they have 8.8 percent .8 and let uh, finally from 81 to um, 100 percent this is a top uh, 20 percent their share in the income is uh, 52.2 so this shows the income inequality uh, here is the wealth inequality in pakistan based on a gini coefficient and this gini coefficient is around about uh, 75 percent throughout these years and this is the ratio of top 10 percent to bottom 50 percent and this is 60 and 60 more than 60 percent uh, this is the Gini index uh, of net personal wealth in Pakistan from 1995 to 2022 and you can see the final figure for 2022 is uh, somewhere uh, about 74 uh, percent. Uh, this is the ratio of uh, top 10 to bottom 50 percent of net personal wealth Pakistan in uh, the period 1995 to 2021 and uh, this figure finally for 2021 is 65.19 and this is the uh, top 20 percent average net personal wealth in pakistan per adult uh, from 1995 to 2022 and this is rising exponentially over time Uh, this is the wealth inequality in pakistan this is the share of the top one percent this is share of the top uh, ten percent and this is share of the top the bottom fifty percent so bottom fifty percent uh, has very uh, low share in the total wealth in pakistan around about uh, five percent while that of uh, top one percent is uh, twenty five or twenty uh, twenty five percent and uh, for the top ten percent this is above 58 uh, percent sometime it's 60 uh, percent and uh, uh, many figures for this is uh, 59 and above so this figure shows that there is a glaring income and wealth inequalities in pakistan this is when wealth inequality in pakistan this is the uh, net wealth personal wealth of the top 10 percent share in percentage and uh, this is the uh, net personal wealth of the bottom 50 percent share and this is for the top one percent share so you can see the bottom 50 percent share in total wealth is uh, uh, around about three or four percent while that of uh, the top 10 percent uh, that is uh, around about 60 percent and for the top one percent that is uh, uh, 24 percent up to 25 percent so this is pakistan's population starting with 1950 the population of pakistan was 37.70 and uh, there has been increase over time and uh, for the year 2023 the, uh, the population of pakistan was estimated at uh, 240.49 millions and this is based on the world inequality database that was uh, downloaded from the internet ladies and gentlemen this is the graph of the population uh, that is there is a an increase over time uh, up to this so this is the final figure for the year 2023 uh, with the population of 240.49 million so if you see if you see uh, this population has been increasing and an increasing rate almost exponentially uh, thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, I hope uh, you liked it. Uh, if you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, kindly do subscribe and don't forget to click on the bell icon. You'll get notification about my other videos that I'll upload. Uh, kindly share uh, various videos of this channel.